Ken, okay, it's recording. I am recording now. Okay, so uh, back to back to my agenda. Okay, so the briefing is for the route. Okay, so I want to cover a few points of like uh, the how we are going to conduct this whole session. Okay. Now, so for this uh, route, okay, we are going to start on this weekend, twenty fourth and twenty fifth. Okay, so we will be meet, There will be about seven of us that actually want to push for the whole entire hundred miles. Okay. Uh, and then we also have a lot of runners that you all indicated in the Excel that uh, you all are joining us from which point and to which point. Okay, so we also encourage everyone right to use this weekend to actually also push your limit, uh, because it's really a, a not not every day that we have so much people running together. Yeah, I think it's a it's a it's a good opportunity la. So for example, let's say your longest mileage is only forty two. Please, by all means, challenge yourself to run for 50 or 60, etc. Okay, and the route is planned around the MRT station. So you just have to look at the next station. Yeah, anytime you cannot make it, just bring your just bring your easily card. You can just step out and go home. Correct. Right. Yeah. So it's very, very safe. Okay, so we really hope that everyone will, will push your own limit together with us. Uh, so we will have runners pacer and also cyclists pacer. Okay, so the Mm. Okay, I'll talk about the formation later. Okay, so so at 8 o'clock, uh, we will start from the East Coast Park. Okay, we will gather there for breakfast first. We will meet at the East Coast Park McDonald's for breakfast. Okay, so for those that don't want to join us for breakfast, can just come after 8.30. Uh. So we will do our last check, go to the washroom, take group photo. Okay, we want to start our tracker, our Strava, Garmin, etc. Sharp at 9 o'clock. So we will leave East Coast Park and begin this 100 mile at nine o'clock. Okay, so because before that, we have to call the organizer uh, that we are starting the race. They will be tracking us on Strava, okay, for this 100 miles. Yeah, so the, the event target is that we need to complete this 100 miles within 32 hours. Okay, what we are aiming for is around 28 to 30 hours. Okay, I think it's very possible if there's no heavy rain or etc. Okay, we, di we did uh, allow some buffer. La. <coughs> okay, so we are, we are Leave East Coast Park at nine o'clock sharp and head towards Yunos MRT. Okay, so that will be our first MRT station. Okay, so uh, and we will have people joining us from Yunos MRT already. Okay, so what I want to brief is how will people join in and out? Okay, so as you are aware, right, we have a very big group. Okay, and the current situation is, of course, we cannot run more than five person per group. Okay, so we are going to have three, three grouping. Okay. Each group will have a so-called team team leader that is uh, the full runner, the full 100 miles runner. Okay, so in the Excel sheet, right, you go and take a look. Okay, for those that are coming in, not at the start point, right? I have indicated there which MRT exit. Okay, you must know which exit. Please don't wait at the wrong exit. Okay, there's exit A, B, C, D. You know, you don't wait at the control station. We are not going down to the control station. Okay, so you must uh, meet us at the correct exit point. Okay, uh, M. Please be there before us. If you reach there and you're not there, right, then we are going to we will be running off. We will not wait for you. Yeah, you can take the MRT to the next station and join us again. Uh, no worries. Okay. Or, um, or either that can run after you guys. Yeah, or, or you feel that you cannot catch up. Yeah, please, please, please do so. Lah, okay. <laughs> now, some of the stations, especially those stations that are above ground, right? I think it's pretty straightforward. Okay. Uh, for those maybe underground station, uh, I would suggest you go to the next station uh, by, by train you faster. Okay. Uh, sorry, Andrew. Yep. Uh, what okay. if it's the other? Sorry, Andrew. What if it's the other way around, like we're waiting there for let's say thirty minutes to an hour? Yep. Okay. So you are you are you are expected to be there earlier to wait for us. Okay. So for um the earlier station, right? Let's say you know Spaliba. Okay. The first, second, third station, right? I think the discrepancy will be marginal. Will be a little bit. Okay. Okay. But. Because of the snowball effect, right? Okay, the difference can get bigger and bigger. Okay, please understand uh, the the estimation of time, right? At the Excel sheet, right, is a uh, best estimate based on a certain pace that we will be doing. Okay, uh, we will not be actually using uh, Garmin Live or Strava Live, etc. Okay, we will do live update of photo posting. So that chat group that all of you are in, okay. Please use that chat group. Okay, don't don't throw bad pictures. Okay, so I request for that for this weekend, right? Please don't spam the chat group with uh 
we chit chat. Okay. Uh, as soon you come in, okay, the station. After that, you leave the you leave the group, right? Okay. Do not throw back your photos because we want the photo to be real time as as much as possible. Okay. So every time we reach the MRT station, right? Okay. We will actually take a photo. Me and Brian, uh, me and Ronald, sorry, we will take a photo and send in the chat group. So you all can see that, okay, where are we now? You understand? So for, for those that are joining us much later, let's say you are joining us at the red line or the circle line or the downtown line, okay? You have to, you have to watch the, which station are we? Okay, if the, the timing can be way off, can be one or two hours difference, possibly, okay? But, maybe, um, but what we can assure you is that we will definitely continue the event, be it rain or shine. This is a rain or shine event. So you do not have to worry that, okay, oh, it's raining. Are they going to, are they still running? Will they, will they still continue or will the event be canceled, etc.? No matter what situation happened, thunderstorm, we will still continue. Yeah, we have to complete the whole event within 32 hours. Okay, just that you, 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 you estimate the timeline. So you look at which station we are, we are to decide what time you leave your house. And okay. the question. The photos, yep. um, what, what um, we did with uh, one of the K13 events is uh, had, there was a second group in WhatsApp created with photo share. Sorry, sorry, Josie, can you speak up? I can't hear you clearly. Oh, sorry. Um, for the recent event on uh, obstacle course, we had a second WhatsApp group which was temp photo share. Maybe either you send us a Google Drive link or uh, we have another WhatsApp group where we can just put in the photos and videos. Um, it doesn't distract. Up to you, I think. It's quite nice. At least we, we let you and Ronald uh, be in control of the main group where you are focusing on the 100 mile objective and those updates, which are just to make sure everyone is timely. Um, on the second one, maybe you give us a link to a Google Drive share folder or something mm -hmm. else. Uh, and then we can just upload or, or we can put a second WhatsApp group that is less, uh, less structured. Okay, also, also possible. Uh. Okay, uh, you, let me, I'm let just, me I'm just suggesting. Yeah. I have a question. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh. Very, very... <laughs> um. That's not me. That's someone's background. Okay, okay. You want to speak out or you want to type in the chat box? Okay, uh, okay like, like assuming I'm, I'm joining from Somerset. Okay. So which exit should I be waiting? Okay, you look at the Excel, it's updated there already. Oh, there yeah. is, huh? Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. We updated the Excel spreadsheet, uh, which, which are the exit. Of course, we only update only those that have people join in. Uh. Those okay. stations that no one is joining, I didn't indicate anything. Somerset have I indicated already. Okay, okay. Yeah. No worry, thank you. Thanks. Okay, so uh, let me continue. Okay. So, uh, so Brian, I answered a question, right? Okay, so um, if you do a good estimate, right, you should be there just uh, maybe five minutes earlier, then you should see us arriving, okay? So you, by now you already know you're in either group one, group two, or group three. So uh, please go to the, the group, uh, okay? So group one, okay, will be led by me, Ronald, and Trisha. So we will be the one that was, will navigate and uh, Point of direction. So the formation, right? The formation of the of this Saturday, this weekend run is that okay, we will have group one, okay, the all the five runners, then we will have a cyclist, then we have group two runners, then we have a cyclist, then we have group three runners. Okay, if we have another cyclist, then the, the, the third cyclist or the fourth cyclist will be behind group three. Okay, so we will be just running in five, right? Like maybe uh, three meters apart. So it's still definitely within the visual range. We can still see each other. We will, don't worry, we will not get lost. <clears throat> so the first cyclist, right, will be permanently Raymond. Like. Raymond will be the cyclist that will do the 100 miles with us. As for the second cyclist, right, we will be, it will be rotated by the different cyclists, okay? We got Yongxian, uh, Petra, Yvonne, uh, no, there's quite there's a few cyclists are uh, Steve, etc. Okay. Okay, so let me go back to the, the route. Okay. So we will leave um East Coast at nine o'clock. So we will head towards Unos. Okay, so Unos will go down the west, uh the, the green line towards the west side. Okay, so uh our first upstream stop will start at Lavender. 
for there's a there's a McDonald's there. We we'll just have a great ice cream. Okay, so we will have a lot of multiple stops for hydration, for toilet, all these things. Okay, the weather is hot because I know we start at the daytime. So we will have, we will plan for all these uh, all these breaks. Okay, but I still encourage everyone to carry along some water lah. Okay, despite that we have a lot of uh, breaks also. Okay, so I will talk about the major breaks that we actually will stop, sit down to have some dessert or have a meal. Okay, so we will go down the first um, the first dessert break is at Tiong Bahru. Okay, so we will go to Tiong Bahru Market and have some askacang. We will have some dessert there. Okay, then after that we will proceed on. Okay, all these breaks are also also important because. For the 100 miles runners, right, we need time to charge our phone and Garmin. Uh, okay, so that's why we need to have all these breaks inside in between. Okay, then after that, we will continue running. Okay, we will have our lunch break at Clementi before Clementi. Okay, so after Clementi, we will go to Joe East and then we will go upwards the red line. Okay, then we will have our dinner uh, before Brother MRT. Let me check if I miss anything. Then after Brother, okay, we will have a dessert break again at Newton Circle. Okay. Then after Newton Circle, the next supper break will be at Paya Leba. Okay, by then it will be night time already. Then after that, we will continue to run okay, throughout the night. In between, we will have a shower break at Marichi. Yeah. So what happened is uh, the all the full runners, right? We will actually put our staff at the marriage locker first, so we do not have to carry along. Yeah. So by the time we reach there, we will we will take a thirty minute shower and break, and then after that we will leave our thirty staff there in the locker again. We will go and collect back the next day. So after marriage, we will continue to run. Okay. At breakfast, right? Okay. If we reach Bangkulan by eight o'clock, we will have the breakfast break at Bangkulan. Okay. If we if you're on track, we reach that earlier, right? Then we will push the breakfast break to Jalan Baru, J J Gelan, Gelan Baru. Okay, that, and that will be our last break. Then we will run back to Budok North. Okay, so Budok North Blue uh, Downtown Line Station will be the last MRT station. Then from Budok North, right, we will run back towards East Coast Park. So the start and the end is both at East Coast Park. Okay, in case there's any like, uh, Insufficient mileage, right? Okay, because there's uh the full runners that several us, if there's different in the GPS tracking, right? There's insufficient, let's say we shot a five kilometer, etc. Then we'll just complete the outstanding along East Coast Park. Okay, but if it's enough, then we will stop there. Yeah. Then we will have our celebration lunch at East Coast Lagoon. Okay, so anyone got any questions about the about the route? It will always be like to the next station. Uh. We will not skip any station. Okay, so the green line from Yunos to Jurong East, then Jurong East will go up, come down at Dobby God. We will change to circle line. Then we'll go past Plaza, da, da, da. Then we'll go the circle line all the way until Harbour Front. Then we we'll go to the downtown line. The downtown line, we will go until Budok North. Then from there, we'll come back to East Coast Park. Okay, something else to add uh, on behalf of Andrew. Uh, this Ronald here. Okay, um... We have also have stated the station exits that you all, are, all the supporters are supposed to wait for us. So at the various stations, right, we actually indicated the exit, like exit A or exit B. So just in case uh, you don't know which exit to go to, um, it is actually indicated and updated in the Excel sheet. So you all can just refer to the Excel sheet and you will be able to find us. Alright? Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Rona. Okay, so just now I was talking about the three group, right? Okay, group one will be... Uh, me, Trisha, uh, Rona, and the uh, Pacer Runners. Group two will be Jessica, Lawrence, and the assigned Pacer Runners. Then group three will be uh, Hansel and Lizzie, okay, and all the Pacer Runners. Okay, but this is just an uh, arrangement so that we do not have too many people in one group. But let's say if you see that other group have like only four person, if you want to run to the first group or you want to run to the third group or you want to swap with somebody because you want to talk to someone else, okay, we are actually totally fine. Okay. A, a, a situation that, may, that will happen, right, is that some of the station, right, we have more than 15 runners. That means we will have more than three groups of five runners. Okay. So what, what we don't want is to have the fourth group. So what, so when this happens, right, we need to have subgroups. Within group one, right, you may need to run three, three. Let's say there's six person. You need to split out again, three, three. 
Okay, so maybe just put another one meter, two meter apart. Okay, let's say there's six runner in group two. Then again, you have to run. Uh, let's say there's there's seven person. Then so you have to run four, three. Okay, yeah, it's going to be amazing. We're going to have so many people running, and with cyclists also. Okay, so I just recap the important point. Okay, whoever is joining in, please be at the MRT station before that. Okay, look for the right exit. Okay, wait for us to arrive. Once we arrive, we will take photo. Please, you please join the photo. Okay, then once group one reach, okay, then group two reach. Once group one see that group three have reached, group one will start to run off. Okay, so we will not hold. We will not. We will not wait at the MRT station to to chit chat there. One. Okay, so it will be just a one minute to maximum two minute stop at the MRT station. Then we will just continue already. Okay, that's why I say if you actually miss us, if you are late, we will not wait for you. You just join us at the next station. Okay. Okay. Uh, also for everyone, uh, if you are if you are doing this, uh, please take photo lah. Uh, okay, it will be nice also. Okay. Some more some more uh things about the run. Okay. Some of you are concerned about like what if I run too slow? Okay, I cannot catch up. <clears throat> then how? Okay, I think I uh, already assured that no, we are we are running for hundred sixty one kilometer. The pace will be slow. We are not running like a, a typical kind of like marathon ten kilometer kind of speed. Okay. I trust that actually everyone can keep up with the pace one. But let's say if Along the way, let's say let's say you're not feeling well. Let's say you got urgent stomach ache. Okay, you need to go to the washroom. You need to dis break off from the group, etc. Okay. Uh, or, or let's say you injure yourself. Okay, you couldn't really want. You need to walk for a while. Okay, you got stitches. Okay, there's a lot of possible situation that may happen. Okay. The 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 thing is, the main group will not stop to wait for any one of you. Okay. So let's say if you really you know um cannot catch up with the the main group right okay, but you still want to carry on okay either you meet yourself uh you 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 take one station to the next station so they got enough time to rest or if not you have to DQ like, you have to you have to drop out from the from the main group okay because you you have to understand that we have to uh, we have a timing to meet okay so if you cannot even catch up with our kind of speed right uh, we cannot wait for any 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 single one like, because then you will drag down the whole group. Okay. The second thing is okay because we are running MRT, so you also will be expecting that we'll be running through a lot of neighborhoods. We will be running through a lot of uh, a lot of crowds. Okay. So, what if we are we break chain because of traffic lights, because of like uh, corners and turns? Why the second group lost the first group, or why the third group lost the second group? Okay. <clears throat> so as much as possible, right? Okay, we have planned the route right in such a way that. Uh, it's, it's actually on the main route, okay, we can see each other. When we reach the traffic light, right, okay, we will actually slow down. We will not rush across, uh, we will wait for the, the next group to catch up first, then we will go off together. Okay, but within the within each group, right, because the, the gap is only about two to three meter, right, I don't think uh, you have a, we have a problem of like always breaking chain, uh, okay. So please ensure that each group, right, you always can see the group in front. Yeah, you have to follow that pace that the front group is running. Okay, any questions about this? <clears throat> okay. Andrew, when you're talking about pace, you might want Sorry, to... who's talking? It's just... Uh, Jahai, I want to indicate roughly the pace that you're going at. I think uh, not everyone knows. It's it's really achievable to, to, to stay on the pace. Okay, so... It's not a rushed race. We... We... Uh, if we can't really give an exception because really it really on the, on the ground right we have to see because um the, if the weather is too hot we will, we will slow down even further yeah so uh, I, I think no worries uh, just just pull out okay can okay um Okay, the next thing about is uh, the weather. Okay, so you know Singapore weather is like very erratic. Okay, so this weekend there's a very high chance that you will have we have rain uh, and we have hot sun also. Okay, so please all the runners, please take care of yourself. Okay, if you're running the day right, the weather can be very hot. Okay, uh, please bring along your sun protection. Okay, if you need uh, uh, bring along your sunglasses, your cap, your 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 visor. Okay, uh, always drink up. Okay. Now, so uh, you are responsible for your own hydration, uh, okay? When we stop, okay, uh, when we start the petrol kiosk, right, okay, if you need water, go in and grab a, grab a cold 100 plus, etc. okay? 
That also, because we are running a big group, so also help to watch out for each other. If you see someone is really like the face already white color, okay, please sound out also, help to watch out for each other. I think um, heat, heat exhaustion is not a, not a joking matter, okay? It can be quite, quite serious. The last thing we want is to any runners or cyclists get injured uh, for, for, this, for this run, okay? So please, Bring along your essentials, okay? Your, your phone, make sure you got an easy link card. If you need any uh, supplements, power gels, anything, just carry it along yourself, okay? So this is a self-support run, okay? There won't be any logistics support. There's no people there to pass water to you. You have to carry things along yourself, okay? Now, if there's heavy rain, okay? Which, like what I said, is very, very, very highly likely that there will be bad weather, okay? Okay, we will still continue. So let's say if it's a super heavy rain with lightning risk, okay. But we will just go to the nearest shelter, okay. And then we will just change up, okay. You, if you br brought along your, your jacket, your raincoat, you brought along extra shoes, slippers, okay. You, you can change that. But what we will do is after we change up, right, okay. The moment the rain starts to get to a reasonable amount, right, okay. Not necessarily drizzling, okay? as long as it gets to a, the light enough level, we will continue. Okay, we may go, we'll go at a slower speed, but what we want is to continue moving. We don't want to stop at one place for too long. Okay, but we are totally understandable. Uh, we understand if any runners right, feel that it's too dangerous for you, and if you feel that if it's uh, raining and you don't want to continue, you want to, you want to stop at that point, it's, we understand also. Okay, so uh, it's, it's totally fine. Okay, next thing is uh, the terrain, okay. Uh, as much as possible, okay, we are running on proper footpath, etc. But there are some places, right, okay, uh, that we don't have proper footpath. Okay, for, for example, I remember like UT to Kranji. There is there's no footpath for people runners to run. So we may have to run at the side of the road. Okay. Uh, not not, uh, not very often, okay, but if that happens, right, we need all of you to take care. Please keep to single file. Don't just run uh, at the, at the, in the road. Just assume there's no car. We always face the traffic, okay? All this is a basic safety briefing, uh, okay? Um, but I think it's important. Okay, if you see uh, any potholes or uh, any slippery ground, okay, please also sign up. Okay, just warn each other, okay? Uh, and I think it's good. Uh, it's a good practice. Uh, if you if someone voice out, okay, there's stairs, there's LGA, you know? Then you all just echo back and then warn the, the, the next runner. Okay, just watch out for each other. And if you are running on, uh, on pedestrian path, right, okay, also do not just occupy the whole path. We are sharing the, the running path with uh, members of public. There will be also uh, people that are walking, cycling, okay. So when you see people coming, please, uh, please be alert and keep to the side, okay. Again, we don't want to get into bad news for, uh, for, for being obstructing, okay. Like, like we are going around the whole island and then like, you know, we don't want to irritate each neighborhood, okay, because we are making a, a loud noise or etc. Okay, so also be careful uh, with the with the terrain, and keep to the keep to the left, unless overtaking. Okay, we are almost coming to the end. Okay, so for attire, okay, we are not going to standardize any attire. So feel free to wear whatever you're comfortable with. Okay, we we don't have any uh coordinated color or anything because. Anyway, we don't want people to take photo and then we are seen as one big group that know each other, lah. okay? Yeah, so uh, just wear whatever you're comfortable. Just remember that uh, bring along whatever you need, okay? Uh, we advise you to keep some small change and money because whenever we stop at petrol kiosk, right, it's easier for you to start to take out and buy money. Or if you see vending machine, okay, you are taking money. You, we, we, we think that, okay, for me and Ronald, right, we won't be carrying a hydration bag or, or a lot of water. Yeah, because we have a lot of place to actually buy, out, buy water already. Okay. Uh, anyway, uh, we'll be topless. Uh, we will. We want to uh, like just run light. Okay, not carry any stuff. Okay, for for those runners that are also running with us for the night session, right? Okay, if you feel more comfortable, if you want to bring the the extra headlight, you want to bring blinkers for safety, anything, right? Okay, just bring along. Okay. Uh, for everyone, I will suggest you bring along zip or bags, just in case it rain, right? You can protect your handphone also. Okay, okay, last, we are coming almost to the end. Okay, um, for logistic, okay, there won't be any logistic or baggage support, okay? So <clears throat> let's say if um, you have things to carry, okay? If you feel that uh, you want to ask the cyclist, for example, okay, you want to ask the cyclist to help you whether you can carry, right? You have to make your own arrangement. 
Okay. So do not expect, okay, for example, Raymond is uh, going to be there all the way, right? Then you just put your water, your power gel, your battery, just put everything with uh, Raymond. Raymond cannot carry stuff for so many runners. Uh, okay. So make your own arrangement to carry your own things. Okay. Especially for those runners that actually plan to run longer miles. There are some runners that indicated you're on the run uh, 40, 50, 60. Okay. So, so um, make arrangement on how you want to carry along all your essentials. Okay. If you, if you have any questions or you need any help, uh, can talk to us uh, separately. Okay. Uh, okay. So, so far until now, any questions? Any session about safety, about the route, about like, how to join and leave? No, I think it's really clear. I mean, especially with the Excel, it's just can't okay. think of any way better to put it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so uh, Andrew, sorry, one last thing. Uh, sorry, I was disconnected for a few minutes, so I was not sure. I'm not sure if if it's already answered, but may I know the reason why you're not using any Garmin Live or Live Map instead of relying on the photos or oh, okay. for more accuracy? Uh, because we actually uh, test out. Okay, um, the if we share live, right, it will drain out the battery very fast. And we need to make sure that uh, our battery can last long enough for the whole entire 30 hours. Yeah. We, we actually, like what I said, we plan for the brakes to actually charge our phone, but we don't want to just on the, the Bluetooth and the live uh, because we don't need to show the whole world. We just need to let the people here know where we are. Only. And it's only, and you only need to know because you are joining in at the particular station. So you don't need to know all the time. I don't expect you to go home already, still need to watch. I think in the group, the photo, I think is good enough. Lah. But okay, but say, let's say you are, you are concerned, you are worried that you may miss us, right? Okay, you can let us know. Okay, we can make separate arrangement. Maybe before we reach the station, we can share location. So you can actually also see us like running towards the MRT. If you feel more, if you feel more safe. Lah. Is it okay, Brian? Sure, yep. Thanks. Yeah. Okay. So, um, okay. So this, this is, uh, there's no limitation or no restriction. So don't feel stressed. Okay. Let's say if you are put down there in the Excel that you want to run a marathon, but on that day, right on Saturday, you don't feel so well. Okay. You feel that, uh, you are not in the best condition to actually complete the mileage. Right. Okay. Feel free to actually stop earlier if you need to. Yeah. Okay. Because we have, each station is only about two, three kilometers apart only, okay? Some of the station may be a little bit further, lah, but most of the station is on average is about maybe less than three kilometers. So if you want to push on one more station, one more station, please go ahead, okay? If you want to leverage on the energy and the synergy that everyone is doing together, uh, you know your body, okay? Please, please push together. But let's say if you really don't feel well, right? Okay, you, you can start earlier, okay? Don't, 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 not, don't, not to worry about what you indicated because that is just for us to do planning. On the actual day, if you want to push yourself to go more station, or if you want to stop earlier, okay, listen to your body. Is it okay? Yeah. Okay, I, I think I'm, I'm pretty much done. Okay. Uh, I think that uh, that is the essential. Uh, okay. I think for those that uh, for those runners that didn't manage to zoom in today, or you were late and you missed out certain parts, right? Uh, me and Ronald will, will, will do a video and, and send out later. Uh, but right now, okay, so now this is the Q&A. Anyone got any questions or anything you want to clarify? Don't be shy, okay, you can ask now because your question may be, may be something someone else is also thinking about. No? Yes? <laughs> okay, uh, if no, I, I just let you know, okay, uh, let's say we already, we already so-called close the registration, now. but let's say if you got someone else that you want to pull along, okay, you got family members that you want to pull along, you want to, last minute you want to pull your girlfriend, your father, your mother to run together, okay, for one station, two station, okay, it's, it's totally fine, don't worry, okay, just pull along. At most, if we have to be a group, right, we will split to a subgroup again, okay, yeah, if they are, if they are willing to, to be part of this, uh, this journey, I, I, I would love it to, to have them in also. Okay, cool. And let's say if you, you only indicate on the fun part, but later you are, you are so inspired by everyone and you want, to, you want to go back rest and you want to join in again, right? You can also just join in again. Yeah, you can, you can let us know also. Okay, so we'll watch out for you or if you just on the spot, you want to come along, can just come also. Okay, no worries. Okay, I just want everyone to have a good time, have a good run and also break your mileage limit. Okay, this weekend also together. Because we, me and Ronald will be breaking our limit. We will be... We'll be joining the 100 mile club, okay? Uh, so whoever, your piece also push our limit. 
Yeah, even by one kilometer, also good. <laughs> Uh, Andrew, I have just something to share. Yep. Uh, so about the subgroups, right? Um, once the group has passed five in one group, mm. uh, when you split up, uh, the distance between groups are uh, supposed to be three meters, mm. just in case. Like, mm. uh, because we don't know if you meet any safety distancing officers along the way, mm. uh, the distance to keep two uh, is recommended to be three meters apart. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, three meter is definitely within the, the visual range. Lah. Yeah. Okay. And because we are running, like, you know, like we will be crossing. Okay, the, the good and the bad uh, is that we have a uh, quite a lot of traffic lights. So you will always run, stop, run, stop, run, stop. Yeah, you, you're able to catch your breath and catch up. Okay, the bad is it's very destructive also. Lah, okay. So the distance, the three meter is very hard to gauge because everyone will be crossing the road together, you know. Like you will not be able to tell that you are actually in that same group. We are not, we are not wearing uniform. Yeah. But if you are running along the path, like you know, uh, as much as possible, just be conscious that uh, you should not be in a group that is more than five people. Five people. The moment you see a five people, just speak up. When you reach the MRT station, okay, you want to take take selfie, take group photo. Just make sure that there's no more more than five person. Yeah, you may think that you are taking more than five person, then you don't post on social media. But someone else may take photo of you taking selfie of more than five person. Yeah, I mean this is just playing safe lah, playing within the rules. Okay, any more, any more concern? Anyone that want to share anything? Great, okay. If not, actually, I don't have much things left. Lah. Okay, uh, I will still be around for, uh, for another five minutes, 10 minutes. If you've got any questions, you want to stay back and chit chat, can uh, by all means. Okay, if not, right, uh, I think all of you are, everyone here is a very experienced runner. Okay, so the next Two days, okay, your Thursday and Friday, please do not go and chong uh, long mileage already. You should taper down, okay, you should uh, pay good care. The weather is hot, okay, so be it this weekend is going to be wet or it's going to be hot, right? I think you should really start drinking up water, really. You should start, start drinking up 100 plus, you know, uh, do some loading, okay, and start resting your leg. Prepare whatever you need to prepare, okay, uh, and, and set a target, lah, okay, I think it's is, is what I, I will be doing. Set a target on how much mileage you want to clock this weekend together. Okay, uh, and then let's push it together. Can everyone get a, a, a cheer of encouragement for the whole group? All at one go on three, two, one. Woo! Yay! <laughs> I have unmute everyone. I cannot hear everyone. Unmute yourself and cheer. Yay! <laughs> Where is the unmute everyone? Okay. Okay, so, so just in case you have any question, okay, you didn't get answered, or you thought of, you think of some more question in the next two days, okay, or is it, you're just too so shy to raise the question here, just ask in the chat group, or you can just direct message me or Ronald, okay? No worries. Waiting for you to turn off the recording to go off record. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I will stop recording. <laughs>